Have you ever wondered how to start investing? It might seem complicated at first, but it's simpler than you think. Imagine planting a seed and watching it grow over time, that's investing in a nutshell. It's about putting your money to work for you, to create wealth over time. This video will break down the process of investing into simple, accessible steps, demystifying it for you. By the end of this video, you'll be ready to take your first steps into the world of investing. So, what exactly is investing? In simple terms, investing is putting your money to work for you. Now let's break this down a bit. Imagine you're a gardener, and your money is a seed. You plant this seed in fertile soil, water it, and give it plenty of sunshine. Over time, this seed grows into a tree, bearing fruits year after year. That's investing in a nutshell. You're essentially buying assets, be it stocks, bonds, real estate, or even a small business, with the expectation that these assets will generate income or increase in value over time. It's a way of building personal wealth and securing your financial future. It involves patience, discipline, and a dash of risk-taking, but the rewards can be significant. Remember, the goal isn't to get rich quick, but to grow your wealth steadily over time. In other words, investing is about making your money grow. Now you might be asking, why should I invest? Well, there are several compelling reasons. First, investing is a proven way to build wealth over time. It's like planting a seed and nurturing it to grow into a sturdy tree. Your investments too can grow and yield fruits in the form of returns. Second, investing is an effective strategy for saving for retirement. By investing a portion of your income regularly, you're setting aside money for the future. It's like creating a safety net for yourself, ensuring that you have a comfortable lifestyle even after you stop working. Third, investing can help beat inflation. By growing your money at a rate faster than inflation, you're ensuring that your purchasing power doesn't erode over time. However, it's crucial to understand that investing also involves risks. Therefore, careful planning and risk management are essential. Remember, the goal is not to get rich quick, but to build wealth steadily and sustainably. Investing is a powerful tool for achieving financial goals. Ready to start investing? Here are some simple steps to get you started. The first thing you need to do is to set clear financial goals. Are you saving for a down payment on a house? Funding your retirement? Or perhaps you're aiming for financial independence? It's crucial to identify what you are trying to achieve, as this will influence your investment decisions. Now let's dive into the different types of investments. There are stocks, which represent ownership in a company. When you buy a stock, you're essentially buying a piece of that business. Then there are bonds, which are essentially loans that you give to companies or governments. In return, they promise to pay you back with interest. Mutual funds, on the other hand, are a collection of stocks, bonds, or other investments managed by professionals. As you explore these options, you'll notice that each type of investment carries its own set of risks and rewards. Stocks might offer high potential returns but also come with higher risk. Bonds are generally safer but offer lower returns. Mutual funds offer diversification, which can help spread out risk. Understanding these trade-offs is key to building your portfolio. Once you've got a handle on the different types of investments, it's time to do some research. Look at the historical performance of the investment, the reputation of the company or fund manager, and its future prospects. Remember, past performance is not indicative of future results, but it can give you an idea of how the investment has managed through different market conditions. After selecting your investments, the final step is to regularly monitor your portfolio. This doesn't mean checking it every day, that can lead to unnecessary stress and rash decisions. Instead, set a schedule to review your investments, perhaps quarterly or biannually. Remember, starting to invest is a big step, but it's also an exciting one. You're taking control of your financial future, and that's something to be proud of. So, take that first step and embark on your investment journey. Let's quickly recap what we've learned today. Investing is essentially putting your money to work, allowing it to grow over time. The benefits are manifold, from building wealth to achieving financial independence. Starting out might seem daunting, but it's as simple as setting clear financial goals, understanding your risk tolerance, and choosing the right investment options. Remember, every successful investor started somewhere. So, are you ready to start your investing journey? The world of investing awaits you.